best to be to have a yearly check. And you have a laboratory that's almost all over the country. And if you have the symptoms of what I mentioned, you easily get fatigue, your low performance level, your dismake, when you're just with my number, pagod ka na, hihingaling ka, or nahihilo ka, like, I'm not used to this, but I feel dizzy, no? This may be symptoms that you may need, and before you can really get to a doctor, the best would be have your blood check. And I think the initial campaign was good. It sends the signal, you need to know what is your level. And from there, work yourself into a maintenance. And to answer the question, not all iron are created equal. Not all vitamins are there for the taking. What is important is that you have to know what you need. I can get your vitamins A to Z, and I could follow all the diet in YouTube and in internet and in the web. I could follow all of them but still not get the right treatment. To advocate checkup is good, but it also means that you have to go to the right doctor. Should I go to a internist? Should I go to a hematologist? You will be surprised. Many kidney diseases are discovered because they're anemic. A lot of Filipinos have diabetes and kid with kidney disease without knowing it, except na join sila ng bandwagon, nagpa-check up ng hemoglobin, and the doctor in the group says, Sir, ang baba ng hemoglobin mo. And so, he said, but I'm okay. I've been, you know, I've been tedious with my, with my exercise, with my diet. And you know, the first manifestation is iron deficiency. And the cause? It's kidney disease. So it's really tahi tahi na problem. It could be one cascading into the other. So I hope that lengthy answer. Yes. That's